today I'm going to show you how to make the southern boiled cabbage. It's so simple and yet so delicious. So I've got the ingredients assembled here. Um, it calls for one head of cabbage. Now if you've got a small head, that'd be fine. These are massive, so this is actually only a quarter of a head, but it's a pretty good size. It'd be the same, same as if you had a small head of cabbage. Two tablespoons of butter, two tablespoons of olive oil. Then you're need, going to need a half teaspoon each of salt and seasoning salt, or whatever type of seasoning you prefer. Uh, some fresh black pepper and about one and a half to two cups of chicken broth. You could use water, but chicken broth really makes it taste good. So your first step, if you've got a whole cabbage, is to cut it in quarters, and then you're going to want to remove that hard stem. So just sort of take your knife and carefully cut out the stem. I'll put that aside. If you've got any other bits left, you can go ahead and trim those out as well. Then you're going to want to cut each quarter into one inch wide strips. Now because mine is such a huge quarter, I'm going to go ahead and cut it again through the middle. Uh, but if yours is smaller, you wouldn't necessarily need to do that. And then again, just cutting back about one inch size strips. Okay, so we're going to start by adding everything except the cabbage into a large saucepan, one big enough to hold everything. So I'm going to start with my two tablespoons of oil, butter, half a teaspoon each of salt, and seasoning salt, and fresh black pepper to taste. As you can see, my butter is melted, so now I'm just going to start adding the cabbage, and then pour in your chicken broth. Now, you're meant to sort of stir this around and toss it a bit to coat. I don't think that really matters that much. As you can see, there's not a lot of room. This cabbage will shrink down in a little bit. Uh, but mainly, I'm going to bring this to a boil. A lump. Some of it's going to be under the liquid and some of it's not. That's okay. It's still going to cook and steam just fine. So I'm going to cover this, bring it to a boil, and then we'll reduce to a simmer. It's been simmering for about 12 minutes. I'm just going to give it a quick stir. And you can see that it's very tender on the smaller pieces, but what I'm going to check is these larger, denser pieces. They're pretty good, too. So I'm just going to go ahead and remove that from heat. It's ready to serve. So there you have it, southern boiled cabbage. Uh, it's just absolutely delicious and such a quick and easy way to make this. I love uh, cabbage, and this is a nice side dish for any low-carb plan. Today I'm serving it with these hamburger patties with a creamy tomato sauce. That's a low-carb, high-fat recipe from DietDoctor.com, and you'll see that one in the next video.